In its one-week compliance enforcement operation in Teso sub-region, National Drug Authority has arrested suspects found illegally selling veterinary and herbal medicine in Bukedia Kato Market, Katina, Ochapa, and Mokora Markets. The total of 10 suspects were arrested. The suspects were found in possession, displaying, selling, and advertising human veterinary and herbal medicines. Charges have been preferred against them. The charges include possession of classified drugs, illegal advertisement, carrying on a business of a pharmacist without a license. According to district leaders, authorization of licensed pharmacists was keenly made, but hawkers, whose operation is unknown by authorities, have on numerous occasions dodged checkpoints which pose a greater health risk to people consuming their drugs. As districts, we have approved uh, drug shops that meet, meet the standards. And in this way, these drug shops are registered, they are approved by districts and also approved by NDA. Otherwise, if we allow these hawkers who move from, who pick medicines from sources that we, are, we don't know, we will be putting the public into very serious danger. Police in the region had to explain its role and expectation in this operation and urge the public to work with the institution in ensuring safety for all in this nation. The nine people are on remand and we are not only ending there, but as we are enforcing this, the district authorities should come up to back us up. Teso sub-region is one of the regions with the highest percentage of drug hawking and sale of drugs in makeshift markets in the country. Her public is advised by National Drug Authority to resist persuasiveness and purchase drugs from licensed outlets from which safe drugs are purposely sold to save lives. Joshua Kagoro, UBC News, in Teso sub-region.